It's the Metro Holiday Classic hosted by Gil St. Bernards, the Knights always playing a tough schedule, and that would continue on Friday night as the nation's 15th ranked team, Imhotep Charter out of Philadelphia, makes the trip to Gladstone. Early on in the first quarter, this is Brad Buncha, and he finds a cutting William Yarbrough for the layup. Gill goes up 5-0. Then, Paul McKehy, see you later. Head fake to get by the defender, and McKehy finishes with the first layup. He gives the Knights a 7-1 lead with four minutes to play in the first. But Imhotep is highly ranked for a reason, and the Panthers would answer back in a big way. Fayton Wesley knocks down the corner three, then Bernard Leitze with the Euro step and finish on the break. It's a 12-2 run by Imhotep, capped off by Devonte Canty for three. Panthers have a 13-9 lead with six minutes to play in the second. And back and forth we went in Gladstone. Paul McKehy steps into the passing lane, and Mulcahy goes coast to coast with a finish and the foul. Count the basket for Mulcahy. Gill ties the game at 15 with 3.45 to go in the first half. But with time running down in that second quarter, this pull-up three from Dimir Bishop is gutsy. Bishop with the crossover and jumper that gives Imhotep a 24-19 lead as we head into the half. Third quarter now, Bishop picks up right where he left off. The 6'5 guard, he's long and rangy. Smooth stroke from three from Bishop. That makes it 27-19 Panthers. But this Gil St. Bernard's team never goes away easy. Alex Shackney fights for the offensive board, and Shackney puts in the bucket. That cuts the Imhotep lead to three. It's 30-27. Then the Panthers get out on the break. This is Sharif Knox flying in for the putback on the opposite side of the rim. Big time dunk from Knox as play intensifies in the third quarter. And this Paul McKay, is special. He's six foot six with speed and handle. And look at the spin move right by Bishop. Mulcahy finishes with the left hand. It's 37-29 Imhotep. But every time Gill would get close, Imhotep had an answer. Jamil Riggins with the running finger roll in the lane. Such a well-balanced attack from this Panther team. Then Dante Scott looking like Jordan in game six. Smooth crossover and jumper from the top of the key. Dante Scott pushes the Imhotep lead up to 16 at 52-36 and Gill would have one more run in them late in the fourth. Mulcahy hits from NBA range on the three. Then John Yoss adds another three from the corner. It's a 10 point ball game, 52-42 Imhotep with two minutes to play in the fourth. But the Panthers are able to put the game away at the free throw line. Phaeton Wesley knocks him down as Imhotep goes on to a solid 58-44 win over Gill St. Bernard's on Friday night. Jamil Riggins led a balanced scoring attack with 13 for Imhotep, and Paul McKay was terrific for Gill, finishing with 22 in the loss. Great effort for the Knights, and they have a chance to get right back on the court on Saturday, facing off with another talented team in Roselle Catholic as the Metro Holiday Classic continues. Looking forward to bringing you highlights of that game right here on Jersey Sports Zone. Reporting from Gladstone, I'm Alex Lorenzo. Want to see highlights and features from your favorite school? Jersey Sports Zone is entirely supported by our great sponsors. Email marketing at jerseysportszone.com to get your business in front of our loyal audience and highlights from your hometown.